Okay? What it do, ladies and gents, boys and girls, Terrence here. We are back with another video. And today in this video, you guys, I am going to get my hair twisted. It's going to be like a little daily vlog. If you're bored, watch the whole video. If you're not, watch the whole video. Uh, shout out to my OG. Shout out to all my subscribers, man. I appreciate y'all for tuning in. Today is just going to be like a little, a little daily vlog today. I'm just cooling it. I'm going to probably go and check out... Um, I'm gonna probably going to check out the Nike store. Um, probably get like a bite to eat or something like that. I had some plans, but plans got... I had some plans, plans that got canceled. Like, you know what? Just grab the camera. You guys will come along with me. Um, if it is your first time tuning in, please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I got a lot of good content. Got, I got a lot of old content too. So if you're curious, go check out some of my older videos. If not, that's fine. Chill out. Watch this one right here. Um, I'm cool in the day, y'all. It's a real chill day. Um, cool, crisp day today, I can't say. I know some of y'all are probably too tough. Really never seen me with my dreads out. I'm going to get my hair twisted up, y'all. And if you can see how long my hair is, hold on. I'm trying to get, I'm trying to, get it to it where y'all can see it. Hold on, y'all see this? Right, you see that? Crazy. Tell me about it, right? So, with that being said, you guys, um, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and uh, let's hit these streets. Last time I got my hair did, um, I think was June first, my grandmother's funeral. Recipes of my grandma, I miss that lady every day. I remember, I'm gonna get my hair did then, and I was telling myself, I was like, man, I'm, I'm gonna try not to. Um, I was telling myself, I was like, man, I'm, I'm gonna try to um, try to keep up with my hair, try to keep up on it. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, try to keep up. From me getting it did, y'all hear my seatbelt thing? I didn't really put my seatbelt on. Um, but I was telling myself, I was like, you know, I'm gonna um, I'm gonna stay up on it because sometimes, bro, just just I'm speaking on me. Dreads, I will sit down and let them things, bro, three, four, five, six months. I remember one time it took me like what seven, eight months to get my hair when I when I get my hair did, you know what I'm saying? And I was like, golly. And then when the, when the lady was, uh, when I was taking it down, it took me so long, it took out, all right, my, <clears throat> my mind is everywhere this morning, y'all. Um, it took me a while to take my hair down because a lot of my dreads were stuck together, so I had to pull them, you know what I'm saying? Like, pull them here, pull them there, like, ooh. You talking about the worst. If, 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 if they're like, well, you gonna get a whooping or or, 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 or take your dreads down, you know what, we're just gonna give me a whooping, man. I just, I'm good at game. You know, you feel me? But I can say uh, in the uh, winter time, I don't need no scarf because this is my scarf. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? This right here is my scarf, so I don't need a scarf in the winter time. <laughs> For real. But I am pulling up at the shop. Now, I don't know if they'll let me record off in there, but I'm just going to probably show y'all the uh, before and after. Uh, um, how I'm, I'm gonna show you guys before and after of uh, what it looks like. Uh, so uh, stay tuned, you guys. See you guys in the next clip. <laughs> yes. Okay. Who he think he is right here now? Okay. What the? He cute. You know what I'm talking about? What thinks he is cute? Look at him. Okay. Yeah. Okay. You know what I'm talking about? You might well just call me Rapunzel, okay? Let me show you how I showed y'all many, many times, but you look at it. Look at that. Length. You feel you know how you saw just slap my hair back. Okay. Rapunzel. Okay. You know, and I got a hundred thousand with me. Stop playing with me, man. Hundred thousand. You know what I'm talking about? A hundred on, man. Stop. Hey, you feel me? Been doing my thing. You feel me? Alright. Let's crank up the crank up the Ferrari, man. You know what I'm saying? Crank up the Ferrari. So what we about to do right now? So there is a mall um, that I rarely um, go to. I only go to it when I'm out here. I really can't think of the name of the mall, but I'm gonna go and check out and see what kind of shoes they got sitting on the shelf right now. Not too tough in the market because I got there's a look, look. I've been picking the shoes and what shoes. I had somebody reach out to me. Um, the other, sorry about that. Phone kind of went out a little bit. Yes, but I had somebody reach out to me the other day. Um, it was like uh, you should do more shoe reviews. I will, but this thing, um, 
I am running out of closet space when it comes down to them shoes, so I have to create a whole other space. And also, too, that ain't, that ain't even the real, the real reason. Um, it's just, I'm picking and choosing what shoes I want now. You know, I used to just buy shoes, review. I think this is cool. Couple, a, a few of them in my collection is just impulse buys, but I'm just picking and choosing. Um, a lot of shoes has been sitting, so that's why I'm gonna go out here and check out this mall um, and see what they got sitting on the shelves. You guys wanna ride with me? Uh, I might hit the Nike store, cause the Nike store is in the area. So I might hit the Nike store, the Nike store, I ain't been up there in a while. So, what we about to do, you know what I'm saying? Fresh, you feel me? Fresh, you know what I'm saying? Laced up, fresh out the shower, fresh hair did. You know what I'm talking about? We finna hit the streets for the bunny rolled up, man. You know what I'm talking about? I got all these keys with me like I'm a janitor and things. Let me stop, man. But um, let's hit these streets, y'all. See you guys in the next scene. All right, so change of plans. The mall that I was thinking about uh, was actually on the other side of town. Uh, I don't know why I got that mall mixed up. So right now we at the Auburn Collection and it looks like they got a circus going on out here, y'all. If y'all can see that behind me. See ya. They got a circus going on out there, so I don't know. We're gonna go in here and check out the Nike store instead, which I was coming here first anyway. Um, I ain't gonna lie, I kinda wanna check out that circus though a little bit, but uh, let's see what the Nike store got to offer you guys. All right, so. I wear a size 10 in men's. Um, I go back and forth between like a nine and a half and a 10. I'm gonna check out the nine and a halves and the 10s, but when I first walked in here, y'all, it looked like I just saw some pounder dunks. How you doing, man? Excuse me. Oh, no, they're not the pounders. Look at this, y'all. They got the high tops. All right, let's see what they got. 100 bucks for those? Man, that's not bad. Let's see what else they got. Rogers in here. Oh, the Rogers in the house. I talk Prestos in here, man. Okay. Looks like these Prestos come with ankle socks. You know what I'm saying? And the box is torn. $69. That's not bad. Now they got these guys in here. Now when these first came out, I ain't gonna lie. When these first hit the scene, I really, really wanted these shoes, man. Like straight up. Not too tough so much now. But shoot, they got a tons of these sitting off the hills. Bucks. It's not bad. It's not bad at all, man. They all right. I know sometimes, sometimes when some of the, um, when some people be coming in here, they be getting lucky, finding like J's and stuff like that. I ain't running across nothing like that just yet. Nah, nothing like that just yet. I'm gonna keep looking though. Yeah, drum is. Not bad. So I don't know if there's the Nike website or what. These boxes is great. Every other box I pulled out was just like these. <laughs> They're like, hey, we're gonna give you the discount on the shoe, man. Yeah. But I ain't guarantee the box. Oh my god. Is it meant to be? Is it meant to be? Size 10, y'all. 160. They got the size 10 in here, 160 for the chambrays. I just can't believe that. They got the chambrays in here, y'all. $160 at the outlet. $160. I don't know because I had walked right past that shoe, but someone was telling me like, you know, just go back down the aisle. And I walked back down the aisle and they sent it to the very bottom too, y'all. I'm telling you, check out your Nike, check out the Nike collection. 160, that's not bad, cause they 200, they two, they 200 plus still in certain stores right now. 
So to see them at 160, I was super excited about that. Hold on. Excuse me, though. Okay, and it come with a book bag. That's super cool. All right, let's see what else we got in here, y'all. I think one thing that I need to do more when I be coming into this Nike store is check out the women's sizes. See, I wear a 10 in men's, but it's 11 and a half in women's. And usually 11 and a half, uh, women, women's shoes be having some dope shoes that be sitting around all the time. But I rarely, rarely just come over here and look. But looks like right now they got some, um, they got quite a few peaks in here, man. You know what I'm saying? They got these in here. Look at these. Right? Doing one lows. How much they want for them? 100 bucks. Not pretty bad. Let's see what else they got in here, y'all. Hmm. I don't know if I want to be 6'6 six, six right now, but I mean, they clean. You know? These are fire. Oh my God. I love that purple colorway, man. That purple is so. I love that. That is just so sick to me. You know what I'm saying? Them right there is hidden. Look at that. Easy. Stop playing with your boy. How much they want for these? Let's get that back in there. What's that? 139. It's not my size though. Nike Zoom X. I like these. I really do. I've heard I did reviews on these a while back. Uh, not per, not a personal pair. But I heard these ones over here are really, really comfortable too. These ain't my size either, but these are really nice. I like these. I like that. I like that. I like that tone, man. Look at that tone. I like that. Real super thin, light shoe too. It's super light. How much they want for these? Eighty bucks. Eighty bucks ain't bad at all. Look at the box. Got the RV on there with the cap. Leaves. These are fire. I like them. If I could fit them, I'd have cop them. They're my super cool. Ooh, look at them right there. Fire. What they want? Eighty bucks for the ninety sevens. Fire. I like them. That was super clean, man. Fourth of July, or even just in general. Summer, spring, shoe. I like them. They're right there, fine. All right, yeah. So we got right here. So look, the up-tempo now. I personally wouldn't wear these, but I really, really like that colorway. And they got two different colorways right here. How much they want for this one right here? They want 109 for that one right there. But these are fire, too. Now, I, again, I personally wouldn't wear them shoes right there, but these thing right here is fire. I like the colorway. I don't know, I tried a pair of own ones, man. They were just super heavy. I ain't like them for real. Uh, still sitting on these. Still got these. It's funny because I had an opportunity to get them, man. 119. I had an opportunity to get these shoes, man, man. I totally passed on them. Because I remember those Air Force Ones that came out years ago with the clear toe and people toes was all fogged up. <laughs> I'm good on them. They were that fire too. I like them. Seventy bucks. I really, really like that colorway. I like that colorway right there. These are fire. Seven. I like them. They were that super cool. All right. So I was trying to get the Chambray's. Um, their size ten, they my size. They one fifty nine, y'all. And they still on people's website right now for about one. No, it's for about two hundred plus tax. And the young lady who was helping me out, she said I can get a 15% off if I was signed up with my email, but I'm already signed up. So it probably not like 20, 30 bucks off. So that sucks. But they got them in here for like 159. So I was sitting here like, dang, you know, 159. I don't know, I'm away. I told him away. So I'm just gonna still, I'm gonna check around and see too. Those dudes, uh, if y'all ever been walking in the mall and them dudes that be uh, trying to clean your shoes, bro, some of them dudes be super aggressive. I just had to tell a dude no like six times. And then he asked me, he was like, hey, yeah, yo, come here, come here, because I, I got the Jordan Foles on today. And he was like, yo, yo, come over here. And I'm like, I'm good, man, I'm good. And then he was like, I can't hear it. And I was like, well, me neither. <laughs> so we're in finish line right now. Finish line got a lot of stuff going on right here. I too, man, I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I been having my eyes on these. I really, really been having my eyes on these shoes right here, man. 120, I seen these on the app. I can't remember exactly what app I seen them on, but they were like $80. 
I like the, and it got the gray ones. I'm gray. I like them. No, they do this. And these are heavy. I feel like I'm lifting weights. If anybody interested, ooh, look at that pad in there. And they got the bubble on the sides. They need a whipping, bro. They need a whole whipping in here. Uh, it was some other shoe I was looking at. Okay. The drawers that just, just did not make the retros. You feel me? The colorway ain't bad, but it just did not make the retros. It was another one I was just looking at, though. Where is it? Uh, it was one I was just looking at, though. Oh, this dunk. I like the dunks that went up. I don't know if y'all noticed that. The dunks be like 98. $90, $100, they went up. These were here pretty fire too. Now when I say fire, I don't mean I will buy these guys right here. I just like the colorway on them. More of a Halloween vibe. I don't know what color that is exactly, but they're pretty cool. I like them. And then, uh, turf mold. Um, no. I don't know about it, do them. 120, these things ain't thick. These right here is just giving me Kanye West vibes. Call this dropout. Straight up. How much they want for these? 140. And of course, usual suspect. You know, that. I don't know why they did this to these Air Force ones with the tail on the back. That's ugly. All right. I mean, I'm just, you know what, man? I'm not mad at these. I probably will walk them. It's like they got a live DJ in here today, y'all. I probably, I wouldn't, I wouldn't mind, I would not mind rocking them. You know what? There's actually a couple over here I wouldn't mind rocking. I would not mind rocking these right here either. Will I buy them? No. But if anybody will buy me these, I wear them. How much they wanted for these? One twenty-five. It's not bad. Even the blue ones. We got these real. I don't know, man. I just don't prefer, personally, the high top dunks. I just don't like the high top dunks, personally. They're just me. I wouldn't rock them, you know? They also got these my guys right here. It's not bad. This is like a, a Air, this, this is like an Air Force One that's been doing. This Air Force One right here got two. What? was they it's like they try to do a collab with Timbaland and Timbaland was like you know what I'm gonna back out and they was like we're gonna figure out something like yeah Lee what was what was the purpose of this I don't even know I'm afraid to call it an Air Force One what is that for a second uh I thought they were Goyard when I first seen when I was walking up on these I thought they were the Goyard Alpha One I just it got it, it's giving me Goyard vibes with the little symbols off in there you know, but I did for a second. I thought these would go yards right here. All right, you guys. So I'm in Johnny Rockets right now. I've been in Johnny Rockets. I've been in Johnny, my last time I was in Johnny Rockets when I was in Birmingham, Alabama. That was years ago. Um, but feel me. I'm gonna check the menu out, you know what I'm saying? So we're gonna, we gonna see what's up. Uh, I'm gonna let y'all check the menu out too. My boy is really taking care of me in here. Customer service is on point, okay? Now, I honestly don't really know what I'm about to get for real, for real, y'all. Um, they got a bacon, lettuce, and tomato sandwich. 
Uh, or I might try a hot dog. Ain't no telling because I'm not really hungry, but I need to put some on my stomach. It is about one o'clock, two o'clock right now. Um, and I ain't eating the thing. I know some of y'all gonna be like, that boy just eating, eating them lemons right there. But they got, um, they got Michael Jackson playing in the background. I already know they trying to copyright me in here. For real. God, eat. Mm. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. All right. Ooh. So when I pick out, um, when I pick out what I want, we're gonna get back to y'all in a second. Hopefully I don't get copyrighted for this um, Michael Jackson. I do want to dance though. I kind of do want to dance. Hopefully they don't copyright me for this though, but get back with you guys in the next clip. All right, you guys. So I just ordered the Impossible Burger. Um, now, I didn't want the burger. I just told him, can I get the burger with no fries or nothing like that? Just give me the burger. I was looking, so this me, I was looking for a kid's meal. See, you can say what you want. I don't really, I, I don't really too tough like to order big meals sometimes when I'm out like that. Um, so sometimes I just get a kid's meal and I be straight with that. Oh man, you, you super grown and you, you gonna get a kid's meal? Hey, bro, kid's meal like four, five dollars cheaper. Say what you want, okay? Don't beat me up. And besides, I don't need all that food right now. I'm still out and about. I got a couple more errands to do right now. Um, keep in mind, you guys, I want to say this, man. I really, really appreciate y'all for walking with me. From my day ones to my OGs, I really, really do appreciate y'all for walking with me, man. I couldn't get this far without you guys. I'm trying to get to the top, and I can't get there without y'all. So thank y'all for even if you just thump across this video. If you like, you comment, you subscribe, and you tell them a friend, tell a friend, your brother, sister, mom, dad, anybody. Um, tell them about your boy. You might would just call me a friend or a cousin or that cool homeboy. You know what I'm saying? I really appreciate y'all for rocking with me. You know what I'm saying? So when it's Impossible Burger, I got the Impossible Burger. So when the Impossible Burger come through, we're going to do that review on it. You know what I'm saying? And we're going to slide. You feel me? All right. On to the next scene, folks. Okay, y'all. So we got the so this Impossible Burger right here now. Let y'all check this thing out. Ooh, look at that. You know what I'm saying? Ooh, they loaded that thing too. Look at that. Oh, it look like beef though, but it's an impossible burger. We're gonna give it a bite. Here we go. First bite. Mayonnaise, lettuce, mayonnaise, lettuce, pickles, chopped onions, uh, mustard on it. Yo, let me take another one. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. This ain't bad, y'all. Y'all forgive me for the music in the background. But that music is sky high. This is really good. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is good. I mean, it's like it tastes like meat, but then again, it don't, yo. This is impossible. No. This is impossible, yo. The aftertaste. The aftertaste is what I'm searching for. Hold on, water with lemon. Okay, here we go. This ain't bad, yo. I mean, initial bite, and just because I got all halfway all the way through it, y'all, this right here, I would give it a 7.8 out of 10. It's not horrible. I think it's the aftertaste, though, is what's giving me a little bit. 
that has this aftertaste and let you know like it ain't beef, okay? Mmm. 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 Hey, 7.8 out of 10, yo. What I like about it is loaded up. It's very filling. The bread is super soft. I'm, all, I'm big on bread. The bread is super soft, but it's that aftertaste that's kicking my butt. It's like, haha, we got gotcha. you. You know what I'm saying? Like, for real, though. But I would give this a 7.8 out of 10, y'all. You got Johnny Rockets? Well, if there's a Johnny Rockets around you, try the Impossible Burger. It's not bad at all. Mm hmm. Mm. It got relish on it too, y'all. That's what I taste. It has relish on it, but relish ain't the appetite that I'm looking for. But I tasted something else. It seemed like that relish was like in a certain spot. This is it right here, y'all. Find a bite. Let's go. Mm -hmm. I cleaned that. That wasn't bad. That wasn't bad at all, y'all. And we are leaving the mall, you guys. When I say we, I mean me and y'all. Feel me? Um, y'all probably can't hear me right now because I parked right over here by this freaking, I don't know what this is. I don't even know what made me park over here. Probably because there wasn't no cars over here. But yo, that Impossible Burger was $16. $16 for that Impossible Burger, bro. I couldn't believe that, yo. I'm sitting up here like, what? The Impossible Burger was $16. Don't get me wrong. It was good. Don't get me wrong. It was it was good. But $16, yo, I ordered just the Impossible Burger alone with uh, water with lemons. Un unless the lemons was $5 a piece. But God dang, that was a lot. I ain't even tripping. It's good. Sometimes, ladies and gents, you know, when you go out nowadays, if you sneeze, that's $30. So I'm trying to see if I can hold all my sneezes. But at the moment, ladies and gents, that there right there has been another Terrence P video. If you guys like these daily vlogs, man, let me know because I sometimes I just I be wandering left or right and I don't grab the camera all the time. I you just get up and go. Um, you guys today, what we did, I'm just give you a little run through. I went and got my hair twisted up. So you guys saw me get my hair twisted up. That was super cool. Um, what else did I do? I got my hair twisted up and I was going to one mall, but then again, the mall, I was on the opposite side. So we went to the Nike store. I saw the Chambray 7s in there, which I ain't gonna lie, 159, I should have got them. You know, that's like what, $40 off, 40, 50, almost six, with tax, probably like $60 off right there. Um, the lady was like, I could have got an additional 15% um, discount um, if I would have signed up with my, uh, my email. And, um, and I was like, I could I can't create another email, but it's only 15%. I hope, hope. I had them shoes in high school. I'm gonna probably go back and get them. Um, also, uh, here, Johnny Rock is up. You know what I'm saying? An Impossible Burger was 16 freaking dollars. So um, that right there sucked. But um, other than that, you guys, I'm Terrence P. Uh, that, that right there has been another Terrence P episode. I really appreciate, appreciate each and every one of y'all for tuning in. Um, thank y'all for liking these videos. Thank y'all for just watching. If y'all like these like daily vlogs or these little vlogs that I just intertwine, please let me know, man. I'm super down. Um, and as I, yo, as I always say, on to the next video, folks. Thank you all for watching. Peace.